Well, hello everybody in Teresa's Triple Play. I just accidentally got into my um, my team page. So, <laughs> hello, my name is Teresa and I am on a mission to help you turn back the hands of time and offer you simple makeup tips. So in the tagline, you saw that I'm comparing mascara to your toothbrush, yes. So yesterday I asked a question to everybody. Hey Ashley, thank you for letting me know that. <laughs> so I asked a question um, to everybody about how often you change your mascara. So we got several different answers from, yeah, you change it every three months to you just wait till it's empty and then you pitch it. So today I'm going to give you three reasons why you should change your mascara every three months. That's right, the answer is every three months, not when you feel like it's empty, because you know what happens? You keep it for six, nine, 12 months, right? So anyway, um, so mascara is like your tooth toothbrush. If you didn't already know this, you should change out your toothbrush every three months. So every time you're changing out your toothbrush, you should change out your mascara. And if you're not doing either, then start today by doing both, right? <laughs> so anyway, let me give you the three reasons to change out your mascara. Number one, every time you break the seal of the mascara and open it up, you are allowing um, air and dust and bacteria to get into that tube. So it's just the way it goes. There are preservatives, of course, in there to help, but still you're doing it every day, so you're allowing that to come in. Um, every time you pull this out and you're putting it on your eyelashes again, you're taking that that we used on our eyelashes and you're putting it back into the tube. So again, we it's it's a breeding ground for bacteria. I hate to say it, but it, it really is. And again, I'll say that the preservatives help, but over a period of time, they, they um, work less and less. Okay, and then number three, the biggest reason is if you do that and you don't change out your mascara every three months, you could, I'm not saying you will, you could give yourself an eye infection. You know, our eyes are too precious. We don't need to put them in jeopardy. So changing out your mascara is just a quick, easy step that you can do to keep your eyes good and healthy. And plus, you know, once you start to use mascara so much, it starts to really get clumpy. And once you notice it getting clumpy, and it could be even before the three months, what you do is just take a tissue and wipe off the excess amount on the brush, okay? Because sometimes there gets to be a lot on that brush you wipe it off, and if it's still clumpy after two months of use, then you need to, to get a new mascara, okay? It's just a simple way that we can help protect your eyes because we all need mascara, right? It helps open up our eyes. So hopefully that was helpful. So I would love for you to comment below if you um, did, haven't been changing out your mascara, but you're going to start to change out your mascara, put in the comments below, change mascara. I have made it super simple for everybody to get new mascara. You don't have to think about it. Just use me. I have a mascara club and every three months I'll send you a new mascara so you'll know to pitch the old so that you have the new. So if you're interested in the mascara club, comment below mascara club and I will private message you to get you more of the details. So hopefully that was helpful for everybody to know about how similar toothbrushes and mascara are. Remember how old you are is your business, but how young you look is mine. I will see you all here Thursday. Bye-bye. Have a great night.